Hello, my name is Typical Panda 11. Today, for you guys, it's something new. It's right here. I got uh, a paper circuit. You might not believe me, but it's true. It is a paper circuit. It is a circuit made out of paper. You see, circuits, like you might say, it's just paint with circuit. You know, you probably put something in there to make it like that. Well, guess what? Circuits are like that too. They put copper into a wood to um to make a circuit. So I don't want to hear it from you in the comments down below. So right here, um, I got a multimeter. I got some paint mixed with water. Oh, I got some purple paint mixed with water and salt. A high conscious uh um a lot of soap. You can kind of see on the edges too. It's like a lot of soap I put in there. Uh, but it's mixed with paint and water it's, as you can tell it's so liquidy and i put on here and i got this result i made a kind of circuit out of here and i got this oh damn and i got this um multimeter on my video shack yeah you can see there uh and i got 20 volts right there and i got 9 volt battery right here and you see if i i made these points so then i could put the battery on there there it is I put the battery on there and then put up I try to put this on here I don't really plan this out put up real quick see I'm about to put it on there it's on there. I got it hooked up with the battery going through the wires all the way touching through there. Uh, then I got it connected up here and it's giving off 6.79 uh, uh, volts right there. That's the highest there. It's probably not as high because it's not at, it's not touching well or I think it's just the battery. It's uh, uh it's either a battery or this is kind of like a resistor um, and holding back all that electricity. Maybe, maybe not, but yeah. So I got that there. So look at that. You got 6.82 volts, which is nice, which is actually pretty good for like a homemade like paper or circuit. Like I put these things at the end cause like I was testing it uh, I was testing it off and the paper hadn't dried yet. So I was uh, using this, but I think the paint is Wow, it dried. It dried pretty fast. Uh, some parts are still wet because I put a new layer on it because I want to make sure it was all on there. But other than that, then yeah, it's like it's real nice. But yeah, so you would put it on here. You would make a whole entire circuit with it. Just put it on there. The current starts running through um, there because the salt and the water can um, can um, allow electricity through it. And I just added paint to it so it dried up on the thing and it just goes through across. Or you can probably make an invisible circuit um, with lemon because you know how you put if you put the lemon juice onto the paper, you can't see it. And if you put water on the paper, uh, it fades away like the um, lemon juice it fades away it literally fades away so you put salt and lemon juice maybe or maybe even water with it too and it will uh, become invisible on the thing until you heat it up like with oh uh, with this uh, with heat but yeah um let me see here I think I'm not sure if it could create electromagnetic field it might be able to create electromagnetic field if um if it's the right way I just get some of this and then put it right there just drag it across get a nice touch in there nice current and then put that in there I'm about to test the resistance real quick um, so I can put it on it's probably not going to be that much of a thing it's hard to see it with that. So I'm gonna put that right there. So I'm gonna get these. Put them on 
there. Got them touching. Put a, got them touching the thing. And apparently there's no resistance. Maybe too much resist not enough. Just need zero point something. So zero point um hmm. Again to the same thing. Nada. We do two million. That's high enough. It shouldn't it shouldn't go farther than that. There it goes. Two million ohms. Well, on the resistance for the thing. As I just move it, just I'm moving it a tiny bit. And you can see it as it regulates. Obviously, I didn't put enough on there, but it does work. I think the highest is about one point something ohms. One through. 1.3 ohms, 1.4 ohms, I think it was, of electricity, of resistance, actually, uh, through it all connected up. That's how many ohms it is. Uh, but that's just because it doesn't have enough thing on there. Hold on. Let me make that just a little bit more. Because I didn't put that much on the connection through here, I didn't put like really that much. I just put just a tiny bit uh, for testing. But then like I was like so amazed by it that I had to uh, record it uh, just like right after. So I didn't put that much on it. I didn't really test it too much. Let's spread the paint again. Put some more. Alright, so we're about to check the ohms again. So, this time with just a little bit more extra connection. Hold up. So, put that right there, put that right there, got the two on there. And that is negative. Oh, dang. Point negative right here. You can still because it's drying. I'm not sure. Let me put it on top at the top here. I think it has to be dry before you can test it. But there, but yeah, that was pretty much it. Hold up. Let me see if I. Oh, wow. That's luckily right there. But let me do this real quick. There you go. It's kind of in a. Here it is, kind of like a coil. So let me go get, so I got a nail, oh, oh, oh wow, wow. Drop that, oh, okay. Oh, the nail.
know it's being a little stupid right now, but... Alright, let me pick up this nymph. Put it right there. Get you. Positive, negative. So, just gonna put it down first. Okay. So it's going around. Oh, man, hmm. it's kind of messed up, but yeah, it does work. I don't know if the coil works. I haven't done that yet. It's kind of in a square, so it's probably not gonna work like that. But um, I explained to you guys how to do it. I might make a video uh, if you guys uh, ask me in the uh, in the co comments down below to make a video on how I made the um, uh, the, the solution. But all I did was. Pretty much, you can go off of this. I mix salt, water, and paint together. Just mix them up together real good. Put, I mean, a lot, a lot of salt. Put a lot of it in there. And then, yeah, mix it together. And then you got yourself some paint ink there. And you could probably put it in a pen or a Sharpie or something. And mix it together with that. So then you could just make it so that it's automatically drying with the thing. You just wipe it on there and it's done. You can probably do that, and it'll do that, but I'll see you guys, but uh, thank you guys for watching. Please press that, please uh, smash that like button if you guys like this video, and uh, please comment down below, like I said, if you guys want me to uh, sh uh, show off how I made this, uh, and or you guys want to see more videos with uh, this uh, solution, and I'll see you guys later, and bye!